happy. I don't even know what day it is, y'all. I am just now back in the swing of things. I have been sick as a dog. Sick as a dog these past couple days. But I wanted to come on real quick and do a little unboxing. I got a little gift. So sweet. From our um, housekeeping staff. And wanted to open it on camera and see what we got. Cute little box. Has a card. And it's sweet. A little... Um, soap from Bath and Body Works. Oh, that's so sweet. I love personal touches. Came with the box, little things and a pretty card. Let's see. Card says Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Sweet. Anyway, I'll fill you guys in later. Come on in, Miss Connie. Hey, darling. How you doing, Jay? Good. How you doing? I'm fine. Good. But I just wanted to come in and say hey. Hope y'all doing well. Doing? Feeling good. And um, I'll check in either a little bit later on tonight. Me and my husband have an event to go to. So I will bring you all along for that. Um, a little alumni social, um, Christmas social at a local um, restaurant here in town. So that should be nice. And our nanny slash Charlie's second grandma okay. um, just got here to watch her while we go out tonight. So anyway, yeah, I hope you're all well and talk soon. Bye. Oh, okay, y'all. I just pulled together a quick outfit. Let me flip it around and show you what we're working. Quick pull together outfit. Little jewelry. Hoops. Oh, bracelet. Put the gel my edges down. They get in these plaits, y'all. I'm not washing my hair until mm, Thursday. Deep conditioning on Thursday. Probably when, yeah, Thursday night. So they're going to get these two plaits. And um, this is the fit so far. Yeah. Cute. Cute. I need to figure out how to tuck this part up so you don't see the band of the sweater. But I like it better tucked in. So we'll see. Okay, y'all, I'm finishing getting ready, and I am about to put on some lipstick, but my lips get really chapped in the wintertime. So I'm about to do a trick. My makeup artist um, showed me from a while ago. You like glob some Vaseline. I'm using the CRV Healing Ointment. Love this stuff like Aquaphor. And you put it all on your lips, and you take a spoolie, and you just brush your lips. So you're like exfoliating off the dead, crusty skin, but you're also moisturizing your lips at the same time for the application of your lipstick or lip stain, even lip balm. You do it for like a minute or two. Also, it help naturally plump your lips by having blood rush to the area. So if you enjoy like the maximizing glosses, I don't like that tingling sensation, but if you do, this is a natural way to get your lips to do that. Okay, that should be good. And that feels pretty good. And then you are left, well, little extra spot. It's like right there in the middle. Look crazy, don't I? It's all right. That beauty is pain. I don't quite believe that, but it does have you make some funny faces. There you go. Now, lips are moisturized. Mm, I lied, that one little piece, y'all. Mm -hmm. I'm moisturized. Now I can apply my lipstick and my lip liner and not be looking like Tyrone Biggums, all crusty dusty. <clears throat> All right, I'm going to apply 
buy my favorite liner. This is so old from the hair store. Like, look at this. It's a nub left. I use it sparingly. <laughs> what is the perfect, like, brown, burgundy? Y'all seen that? Brown burgundy color. It's just so pretty. Let's line her lip. Close. It's like your lip color, but better. Hmm? I'm talking to my peeps. Yeah. Pretty. I'm not anything other than like a brown gloss and chestnut or court liner. However, on occasion, like today, I'll channel that of my mother, who was a red lipstick wearing woman. This is old, this is Tarte, like one of their moisturizing lip stains in the color Holly. So I'm just gonna layer this on top. Oh god, you're like tearing up. That on top. Pretty. So it's a hint of color, but mainly gloss. So yeah. Here's the full look I just touched up from work it's like nothing major I got a pimple but I'm not even gonna worry about trying to hide it because it is what it is tonight anyway gotta get ready to go I'll see you when we get there bye head it in Y'all watch Marriage and Motherhood, Gia, her notorious Costco hauls. Anyway, I'm at Costco, getting a few items for the house. Um, water. What I came for y'all came on a work day on the afternoon. I normally come in the morning to Costco, but I was like on E for gas, so I had to come. But it wasn't too bad, it is crowded for sure. So I'm in line to check out. But we did it. Came, we saw checking out Whew, to go home. I don't know what to cook for dinner. My parents are coming in town tonight to visit and i don't know what i'm making no one wants tacos or spaghetti and i don't want to buy takeout so it might have cold cut nah i might make some meatballs and rice and something else i don't know anyway let me show you my card
I'm hot. It's raining, but it's I have on this coat and it's like really hot. But y'all, I bought a mattress pad at Kohl's. Let me show you this box. Look at this box. Now you can't tell me this is not repackaged. I asked a little girl, I was like, um, is this new? And she's like, yeah. Y'all, this box is not new. Look at that masking tape. And it's not even flush. Somebody repackaged this. So I think I'm gonna get a new one because I'm not I'm not gonna sleep on a used mattress pad. I just can't do that. Anyway, it's crazy. Crazy. Okay, y'all. Here's the new one. We can clearly tell it's not been tampered with. How crazy is that? Sell somebody something used. Anyway. Finally headed home. Okay, y'all. Here is the mattress pad rolled out for 24 hours. Um, it's risen up nicely uh, per the instructions. I still need to put it on the bed as well as the mattress cover. But we made it home. The box, the untampered with box is over there. Uh, so thanks for joining along on my um, Cole's Tried It adventure as well as some errands I had to run. Hope y'all are doing good, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye!